Welcome to another edition of What People Really Know About Africa. All right, today we have Vinny right here. I'm going to ask yes, you. <laughs> you go ahead, man. Give me a shout out. All right, hey, Lil Paul on YouTube. Check out my new song, <laughs> Hate Me. Lil Paul, Lil Paul. All right. <laughs> That's what's up, man. All right, I'm going to ask him about what he knows about Africa, like based on what he has been taught on Africa, so that we can actually have some inside yeah, information. All right, yeah. All right Vinny, what do you know about Africa? Like when you go uh, Africa? I know nothing. I know it's a continent. Yeah. Uh, I know. Like, I don't know, be, I'll be in history and there'll be some shit going on, like, in Africa, like, there'll be, like, wars and stuff, and I know that. Uh, but that's pretty much it, man. I don't really know much. Well, when you say wars, do you, did you ever, um, take a second to think that maybe there's, like, peace in some yeah. parts of Africa? Well, yeah, of course, there's probably, like, peace in places, but, like, I just know, like, in the past, I've heard about, like, wars going on and stuff, but... Cause it, I'll just go to history class, but other than that, I don't really know. I haven't really learned much about it, so yeah, oh. like obviously it's probably like peaceful or something here, easy. Yeah, man. All right, I'll just give you three hits about about Africa, all right? all right? There's a lot of trouble going on in Africa, same as the rest of the world. Like when you look at Syria, they're at war. Everyone is basically at war with everyone right now. Yeah. But something I want you to take about Africa today is the people are really welcoming and Africa is a good place. Like when you beautiful cities you can visit in Africa and there's so much Africans can offer. We as Africans migrate a lot because our governments are really not doing what they're supposed to do and greed people don't want to leave power. Yeah. All right, Vinny, I want you to take that today, okay? All right. Yeah. Africa is a beautiful place. If you ever had time, you want to visit, that's a beautiful place for you to visit. Yeah, bro. Thank you so much, Vinny. Right. And you all go check out his YouTube channel, though. <laughs> yeah, Lil Paul. <laughs> there we go. All right. <laughs> Hi, everyone, and welcome to another edition of What You Know About Africa. Today we have, uh, what's your name again? I'm Lisa. Lisa. Nice to meet you, Lisa. And she's from Africa. I mean, her parents are from Africa, so I'm trying to find out what she really knows about home, the motherland. Mm -hmm. All right, Lisa, what do you know about Africa? Both my parents were born and raised there, so I went there maybe 10 times in my life. Oh, wow. Oh, the stories I've heard of it is not very good. Yeah. yeah. My mom, she grew up in the Zimbabwe bush war, or the Rhodesian bush war. So she told me stories of that and how unsafe it is there, a lot of crime. Well, Lisa, there's a lot of crime in Africa. I will admit that Africa is not the perfect place to be, but like everywhere else, there's crime everywhere. All right. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to bring light to the hidden things in Africa. I'm, I'm trying to bring to light things that a lot of people think happens in Africa that doesn't really happen in Africa. The government in Africa is pretty much corrupted. Like mm -hmm. they are really corrupted. But I'm gonna tell you something for someone like you. You're pretty safe in Africa. I will assure you. Like, if you visit the places there, you will be more protected than even the citizens there. Yeah. I mean, I don't know, but Africa is perfect. It's just the people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The people there. The food yeah. there is amazing. I'm saying the food is good, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The, the problem there is just the leaders that we vote. We put these people in power that. They, never want to leave power, they, they invest the money, they stay in power, and Jesus Christ, they have their corrupted government with them, but trust me, being white in Africa, you're pretty safe though, trust me. Yeah. <laughs> well, do you have any questions you want to ask me about Africa, Lisa? Hmm. I can't think of it. <laughs> Oh, it's fine. I mean, thank you so much. I wanted to know what you thought about Africa. You think Africa is unsafe, but I will tell you everywhere on Earth is unsafe. And Africa is pretty safe for you. Mm -hmm. All right? All right, thank you, Lisa. Thank you. Hi, everyone. Welcome again to another edition of What They Know About Africa. And I have Logan here with me. I will ask him a few questions about what he really knows about Africa based on what he has been taught. Welcome, Logan. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Uh, the major thing I know about Africa is it's the biggest continent in the world. It's bigger than Greenland and everything. I 
know that there's Egypt and Ethiopia. Uh, and that's pretty much it. That's all I know about it. So. Oh, all right, love Logan. Africa is actually the second biggest continent is in the it? world. Yeah, <gasps> after Asia. We have Asia oh, yeah, well, as yeah. far as then we have Africa. <laughs> Asia. Okay. And there's a lot of countries in Africa. Actually, I'm really impressed that you know up to three because a lot of people don't even know anything about Africa. We have 54 countries in Africa. Yeah, that is a lot. There's a lot of countries in Africa. Right. And what do you think about Africa when it goes to develop development-wise? Like, what do you think about Africa? Uh, like their infrastructure? Yeah, when it goes to like infrastructure. I don't know if I had it. Since I know nothing about it, I would probably say like, they're, I mean, like this is good, this is bad, and maybe like right here. Ah, yeah, you're right. I would rate Africa around that area too. But one thing I want you to know today before you leave here, Logan, is like, is that even though Africa is all the way down here, Africa has all the resources it takes to be has, great. Has potential. We have everything it takes to be all the way up here. Right. But the problem Africa has is the people. I mean, a lot of us spend time blaming. Europe blaming a lot of people for doing whatever they did to Africa, but it's okay. These people came with colonization and they also brought us civilization at the same time. I mean, everybody knows civilization began in Egypt, but it was only Egypt back all the way back in the days. But yeah, when it was later on in life, they brought us a lot of good stuff. And if Africa is going through hardship right now, it's on Africa. And just the leaders and the people, greed won't leave them. All right, you know that today we have everything we need to be good, but we're not good because the people choose not to be good. Right. All right, Logan, thank you so much. Thank you.